Hello everyone, I'm back with one more activity, this time to prove that one fifth part of air is oxygen. In books I'm sure you have studied, either they say one fifth part of air is oxygen or they say 21% of air is oxygen. What's the difference? No difference. It means the same. If you divide 21 upon 100, approximately the fraction which you will get is one fifth. Okay, so both the statements are correct. So here, let me prove you with the help what of What I have done, you can see this tumbler here. Okay, and any empty tumbler means it contains air, right? It's not exactly empty. So I have divided it into five parts. You can see the labeling, right? One, two, three, four, five till here. Okay, so now I'm going to cover it, cover this on a candle. A burning candle let's see what happens so for this activity in addition to the tumbler which i showed you just now this i have taken a candle you can see this candle and i have poured some colored water i'll add a little more okay then what next i'm going to light the candle so you can see i have lit the candle and now i'm going to cover it with the tumbler which has been labeled right and focus on the candle it's getting extinguished and look at the level of water it is rising yeah yes see carefully now it is it has risen and it has risen to the level of number one you can see that okay and if we focus on the candle again the candle has extinguished. So what actually happened? The candle used up the oxygen present in the tumbler. And how much oxygen was there is one fifth of the whole of the volume of this tumbler. Okay, the whatever volume of air was inside, one fifth of that is oxygen. So this activity proves that one-fifth part of air is oxygen.